Having passed his first major test as United manager Ole Gunnar Solskjaer has now given himself a new problem to contend with this weekend, expectation. It's a welcome headache created by the record-breaking start he's made to life in the Old Trafford dugout, but for the first time under his stewardship United go into the game with Brighton this weekend with expectation on their shoulders. It already feels like it's a case of how many they win by rather than whether they win. Curiosity governed Solskjaer's first few games in charge after replacing Jose Mourinho. Was this really a new dawn for United? After victory at Newcastle the game with Tottenham at Wembley was billed, repeatedly but rightly, as the first major test. Now that has been passed, thanks to Marcus Rashford's gold, the mood is changing quicker than anyone could have imagined. United are back in the chase for a top four place and playing with a swagger that is now going to start bringing a level of expectation with it. Having scored so freely in the early weeks of his reign, United have now won at Newcastle and Tottenham, keeping clean sheets in both games and continuing to look dangerous and quick in attack. Manchester United latest news live, United news and transfer updates as they happen news, PSG stars give their verdict on Ole's United transfers, Kaladu Kalibali how good is he? Opinion, how Lindelof has proved Kara a wrong manager, United fans have decided who they want as club's next boss the fixture list is now more encouraging as well. The FA Cup fourth round tie of Arsenal will be another challenge, but home Premier League games either side of that against Brighton and Burnley are fixtures that suddenly look very winnable. There is an expectation from all quarters that United will simply swat them aside and move on. This is where the challenge has changed for Solskjaer. His start has been so good that, in a way, he's increased the pressure on himself and his team. But the Norwegian and his coaching staff have given the impression of being able to thrive under that pressure to create an environment the players can still enjoy, even if expectations are on the rise. It's also a staff with experience of dealing with the expectation that comes with representing United, thanks to Solskjaer, Mike Phelan and Michael Carrick. That's the challenge of being a manager. Behind every hurdle you jump there's another one waiting to catch you out. A month ago United would have entered a home game with Brighton, a side that have caused them problems over the last 12 months, with trepidation rather than anticipation. That's not the case anymore. This weekend there will be a buzz around Old Trafford of excitement combined with a certain expectation. Having hauled themselves back into the race for Champions League qualification United now can't afford to slip up just yet. With Chelsea and Arsenal playing each other this weekend in the Saturday evening fixture, there is an opportunity for United to close the gap even further, pull away from the Gunners, or a bit of both, if that game ends in a draw.
but then that is expecting they do the job against Brighton. That's the latest conundrum for Solskjaer to deal with as he looks to continue to pass all tests in the United dugout.